behind Pliap for the moment. I'm not sure if that's the uh, buff there, but it, it could be. I'd have to uh, check and uh, see. But uh, no, no it's, well, it's not that now, but it was before. Divine Illumination is up. There comes the Hand of Sacrifice. This game has gone on very long. There shouldn't be another Innovate uh, for Enigs just yet. Switching over, and it is going to be uh, in flame that does go down. And I'm just going to check over with Nix. Yeah, it took. A, it was going to be one more minute for that um, for that innovate. So I think they won the mana war. And I do believe that was divine plea that um, Fracky managed to put up. I I think that he um, he put up his divine plea and then took it off with. Uh, I think it's divine illumination. Uh, one of the spells that either um, is half half cost on the spells, or and then uh, and then hand of sacrifice. So he's done really well. And you can see there, um, just to just to uh, point out that the seven G keyboards from Steel Series, the uh, the um, basically that the the, uh, the keys just pop in and out. You yeah, see, you can just pop them out, and look how easy you just you pop them back in. Child could do that, isn't that fantastic? Yeah. <laughs> well, what a great feature. But yeah, I mean, you saw that game as well. Fracky didn't take nearly as many dots as he did in the in the Ring of Valor, and Inflame didn't have the option to port behind a pillar all the time, as his portal was forced to be in the beginning of the map. And overall, it's just it just seemed a lot easier for the team of TSG compared to uh, the Ring of Valor. I mean, the, the the interesting thing is as well. I mean, do you think another's pulling in um, the healer enough? Do you, do you think he's getting him involved into that fight? Yeah, he's forced to. I mean, he's forced using every death grip onto him because otherwise they're just not going to be able to build enough pressure and and. And you, you, Inflame can't cast anything in that map because he's never he, he never gets away. You know, I mean, the second the second he teleports, they're back onto him like five seconds later. And one of the times that he even had a health tunnel, that one second he does have spell, that his pet was just going to go down. So it's really important that he gets the pressure up when he does have the opportunity to. But sometimes he just can't do it. I mean, it, there's just there's just no time. And yeah, it must be really frustrating, especially playing the DK as another does. Yeah, I mean, you, I mean you, you must feel like helpless sometimes. I mean, there's not a lot you can do. Nunez got a weird option as well because if he pulls in a Nigs and the and the portal comes in, then Nunez stuck. He cannot get back onto Inflame. Yeah, exactly. But pulling in a Nigs could be a really good thing at, at points in the game when he hasn't got um, you know hots up on him. You just pull him into the center. A blade storm could be devastating for him and another, and then it wouldn't even matter what kind of dots um, Inflame is going to put up on the end of that because uh, maybe the damage will be too great.